hello welcome to you in this tutorial so today i'm going to show you how to uh, create a digital marketplace using my themes it's a very popular uh, theme in theme pass or n to marketplace to create a digital uh, marketplace or uh, selling digital product in online so in this tutorial purpose is that to show you everything how we can create a e-commerce website to sell any digital product using this theme so let's uh, see basic feature of this themes so this theme is uh, basically developed or created for digital marketplace or selling any digital products in online uh, like uh, graphics uh, photos videos theme plugin or more it's already uh, uh, sold 500 plus sales already make and <coughs> it's super easy to create a multi vendor website using these themes. And uh, what you, what you can sell with the my system? So you can sell graphics item. You can sell uh, Lightroom preset, uh, WordPress theme plugin, sells ebook, magazine, sells music. Uh, almost uh, the in common or in short I can say that uh, you can draw everything uh, related digital product or sells any digital products using this theme so so <coughs> so first of all let's get started I want to use this theme in this website uh, it is craft.com this this is this website for one of my clients so uh, this is the back end of this website uh, it is very fast wordpress install is installed so if you don't know how to install wordpress so you can contact with me i can uh, help you or uh, there you will get a lot of uh, free tutorials how how you can install wordpress in your website or in your domain so First of all, what you have to do, you have to download your products, my system from Nbantu. You will after login your uh, account, so then you get you get this theme file, my sys. This theme file. You get this theme file, my sys uh, theme first. Then there you will get a lot of file after unzip documentation licensing plugin upload so we don't need a lot of thing we just need uh, this thing so i have moved it in my desktop this things so next i have to uh, upload this thing in my website so how to upload your theme you can get a lot of uh, guideline from the documentation <coughs> so uh, start installation step uh, first you have to we can install in two way using FTP or using WordPress uh, to install this theme using WordPress uh, first I have to go to appearance then click on the themes so I am here so then click on the add theme or add new then click on upload now choose my theme so my theme is my sys uh, I have selected these themes then upload uh, after select this theme then you click on the install now button so it is uh, started installing if you uh, look at my skin bottom left corner it's uploading it's showing the progress
so <coughs> by this time uh, uh, while taking uh, while it's uploading I want to discuss with you if you need any help to uh, help create any e-commerce website or any digital uh, um, product selling website then you can contact with me I have five years of experience so I can help you professionally and give you the, a lot of advice uh, about your business how you can make money from internet you, how you can increase your sales okay so our team is uploaded uh, now installing it just waiting for uh, final messages <coughs> Installing theme from uploaded file myosis jeep and packing the package Okay, so my theme install is successful now I click on active activate okay so my team is activate right now I click on the install plugin here then select all install apply So all team installed. Oh, sorry, all plugin installed. Now I have to active this plugin. So you can active your plugin from here. Click on the inactive. Then select all. Or click on the with inactive plugin. Okay, so my wall plugin activate. Uh, now going to in the now going to in the license section. You have to enter enter your theme first username here and uh, purchase code here. Then click on the save change uh, changes. Then your theme will be activate. Okay, so uh, my license is valid. So I have activate my theme. So now what I have to do. Okay, so there is a uh, signal for me. Uh, that is <coughs> WP memory limit. Uh, uh, we have to increase the memory limit uh, of this uh, team. So let's click on the more info. to increase memory limit what I have to do open WP contract file find the following line near the end of the file uh, 
and then we have to add this code okay so I am going to my cpanel and going to open this file So after install your theme and plugin, you will show a welcome message from the MySys theme and you can find this welcome message from here. So we have to follow uh, everything to do everything professionally or smartly without any conflict. Here the uh, system status. So everything show me is okay but only WP limit so a uh, red signal that they are 4MB. Uh, memory setting but they recommend to keep at least uh, 96 MB so how we can uh, increase this uh, MB limit so here they give a uh, information or introduction as how we can do this so here the introduction from there so increase the WordPress allowed memory size we have to open WP config file then find this line then add this code at in this page so to do this we have to first to log in our cpanel so here is my cpanel then click on file manager and then click on public estimate folder then wp config this is my wp config file then click on edit then edit so we have to find this code where just coffee and okay we don't see this code but no problem we just add this code but before add this code we have to find that it's already added there or not so I am checking so this code not added there so I just add this code coffee and first here so then save changes now we'll reload this page welcome page to check the memory increase it's maybe take a little bit time wp config and wp config define wp demo okay so we added this code and it will take update no problem but we have to just wait a little bit or take a update so what is the next we have installed theme installed plugin activate this plugin uh, activate the license uh, now why what we have to do so now we have to do import demo so click on the demo import okay so here the available demo that we like to import so let's see uh, main demo with elementor main demo with wp bakery uh, myo photo demo elementor uh, then graphics market multi vendor demo elementor graphics market multi vendor demo with wp bakery okay so in this tutorial or in this project i want to create a graphics market multi vendor demo uh, sorry multi vendor website so i'm going to click on the import graphics market multi vendor demo so just click on the import uh, now they want to uh, pop up a confirmation message uh, you should install front end submission before you use this demo 
install email element of press filter for import remove okay i have to wait three or five minutes so okay no problem i want to do this just click on the yes import so now it's importing Okay, as as their notification, we have to wait three or two minutes for just waiting. So um, the demo import has been finished, but there were some important error. Uh, more details about the error in the font log config file. Okay, so our demo is uh, importing finished. So let's see the white site. Wow, it's fully ready. Here the demo. Everything is ready. Just what we need. We just need to change, uh, change the logo, change the images with original content and set up set up the pages so okay so i hope you understand how to uh, install activate and import demo uh, using my system thank you for watching this tutorial so uh, this video uh, uh, in the next video i will show you how to set up pages and others work so i want to end this video in here so i hope you uh, like this video and uh, share this video with the others and subscribe to my channel and if you need any help related to my system wordpress or e-commerce then you can contact with me thank you for watching this video